Okay, so we created risks and when we create risks, we also assign a risk owner. Now let us see uh, how we can maintain uh, risk owners and you know for mass uh, uh, risks. Okay, so in NWBC in the setup work center, you'll go and click on mass maintenance risk owners. Okay, but before we do that, let's take some sample um, risks. Okay, which SAP has delivered. We'll use the SAP delivered ones and click open it and see if any of these risks have been assigned risk owners. Okay, so you don't have any. Okay, so close this. Let's pick another one and see. Okay. The rule set will be global because it's a SAP delivered one, but there is no risk owner, right? Okay, let's pick another one, uh, another high one, B012. Open. Okay, there's no risk owner. Now, how do we, you know, uh, uh, instead of going and assigning the risk owners uh, to the risk IDs, uh, one by one, how do we go and do mass assignments, right? So let's close this. So what you do is you click on mass maintenance of risk owners assignments uh, option, click on that. And then let's say you have, you want to do it for all the uh, high risk levels, okay? And sorry, risk levels and in the business process, Let's say we wanted to do it for, uh, let's say, basis. Okay. Now, if you want, you can choose FI also. But uh, let's choose basis. Okay. And then click on search. Oh, we picked finance. Let's search. Basis. Let's search. Okay. And if you see, the owner ID uh, risk owner ID column is blank, right? Which means these risks do not have any risk owners assigned to them. So what you do is you click on select all and say next. And the only issue here is for all this row, all these risks that you have that you get, you'll have to maintain the new risk owner ID uh, one by one. You cannot copy paste uh, the user IDs. Okay, so if you click on search for the user ID and let's say this is your basis component owner, right? Now if I copy, try to copy paste this, let's say, okay, it's not going to do well. It doesn't take it. So you'll have to assign the, uh, you know, uh, risk owner to each one of them one by one okay by searching and then selecting the owner okay let's do this for all since we have taken a very small group of risks okay so now remember we are doing this only with uh, high risk levels okay we would have to do this with the medium risk levels also so this is a uh, little bit of manual process uh, but it is still good because you're not going to each and every risk one by one and doing the assignment okay so okay let's do this Okay, there's one more thing you need to know is that if, okay, so once you have done this thing, right, click on next and you get an opportunity to review what you're doing, okay, what you're assigning and then you click on next and it's going to give you the 
numbers, right? How many risks the owners you are going to change? All right. So it is already submitted and you see the success messages status okay this is your submit right so it is telling you how many it has changed okay and how many uh, total new owners were assigned was 10 and how many were removed updated were 4 okay now you can close this and let's take b0024 and 06 and see if the risk owner is now assigned to this risk IDs okay open okay so there are four And let's check one more zero six. Okay, these are all high, right? Now this one here's the thing. Let's assume this risk owner that you assigned leaves the company. Now you have to update the risk owners, right? So what would happen is what you would do is you would go back to mass maintenance again and let's say hi. Uh, basis and you let's say search or you can search by the risk owner also if you want to update okay the thing is when you you think you have the owners right so when you select all and go to next you'll have to enter the new owner no new owner here okay now and then you go through the entire process again now if you see here b19 and b20 don't have uh, the risk owner here so select those two click on next see you still have to enter for everybody so even though in the previous screen you think the owners are assigned you will have to reassign the owners again okay so that's the important thing so every single time you will have to redo the ownership if you are changing something okay and mass all right so this is about mass maintenance of risk owner assignments